Hello guys, how's it going? This is Red Scouser FC, welcome to the channel, the one and only Red Scouser FC. Back with you with another video, a new concept, a new idea. Uh, come with, this is the Mini Tins Battle, right? What you see here in front of you, it Mini Tins from the new Panini AXL Road to Euro 2020. We've opened lots of products on this channel. We've previewed lots of products on this channel. We've done tons of UK, tons of German, Polish, uh, Nordic. But I have not done Battle of the Mini Tins. So, what do we got here? We got a Mini Tin from Germany. 24 cards, 1 limited edition, 4 euro 99. The second one... We've got a mini tin from Poland as well. Four packets, but two limited edition cards. And finally, we got a Nordic mini tin with two limited edition cards. So, who's going to win? Germany, Poland or Sweden? Let's crack them open. Let's see what's going to happen. Are we going to pull some top masters? Are we going to pull some power up cards that are hard to come by? Who's gonna win? Germany, Poland, or the Nordic from Sweden? Let's go. Alphabetical order. We'll start with G for Germany. We get one limited edition, which is less than the other two. Will that be a factor? We will find out if this is gonna win it for Germany or not, depending on what we're gonna pull in the packets. All right, so we got two of the Rakitic Hazard Bernadeschi. Let's open it up and let's see if anything good comes out of the German mini tin. Okay, let's go. Let's have some fun. Let's enjoy the hobby. Lads, lasses, here we go. Game changer for Germany. Timo Werner. And all the base cards. That's good stuff. Packet number two. Looks like we got a transparent one. Holland. Group winners. All right. There we go. Packet number three. Nothing special. Comes out a lot, this rising star. All right, last one. Are we going to pull something good from a German mini tin? We pulled an Andre Silva game changer. So, as you can see, nothing really earth shattering. Yes, we did pull two of the difficult power-ups but otherwise we didn't pull any in that special Timo Werner and Silver use the codes lads enjoy playing online here we go this came from the German mini tin limited edition Griezmann, here we go, alright, let's put it here, so I would say, I'd give it, what, about 6, I'd give it a 6, the German mini tin, it's, it's alright, but it's, could be better, in terms of the pulls, alright, Poland, Polska, it's Polska's turn, and the Polish one, we get two limited edition cards. All right, we're going to leave them on the side. Here's our four packets. Let's rip it. Come on, hopefully something good will come out of the Polish mini tin. The cards are rebelling inside. <laughs> Gunter for Wales. If you play online, enjoy playing online. 
Hope you build your team well. I have a strong team with all the codes that I'm passing on. Thank you, San fans favorite. So, so far, two fans favorites. All of these can be found on eBay, guys. If you search eBay, you will find all of these. Odauda, Rising Star for Republic of Ireland. Not in... Really special out of the Polish. Last one, last packet. Then we'll have a look at our limited editions. We'll see if we've pulled anything good. And an Isco key player. Here we go. So. This was the Polish blister. Blister. It's a minute in. Come on, AJ, wake up. Got to slap myself a bit to wake up. All right. So this is what we got from the Polish mini tin. Only one key player. Isco. Let's have a look at our limited editions. Boom. Nice. Seamus Coleman for Republic of Ireland. That's a tough one. And ready? Boom. Fantastic. Marco Royce. Love it. Absolutely love it. I would give the Polish mini tin. I would give that an easy, easy nine. For the fact that we pulled two difficult limited editions. You don't see them in other markets. Unless it's given in a free magazine. And we got an Isco. Look at that. Seamus Coleman. Marco Royce. Brilliant. Brilliant. And this is going to be the Polish taking the lead. For me, anyways, I'd give that about a nine. Here we go. Going to put Marco Royce here. We're going to put Seamus Coleman here. All right. So this is the Polish one. Let's say we give it. A nine? Yeah, we'll give it a nine. Put your thumbs up. Don't forget, hit that like button. Lads, lasses, you liking the video, subscribe to the channel as well. If you're not a subscriber, keep your notifications on. So, you know, as soon as I upload the video, you guys will get notified. All right, let's open the no dick one. Four packets as well. And it's going to have... Two limited editions. Which ones? We don't know. We haven't pulled any hard to get cards so far. All right, here we go. Four packets from Sweden, the Nordic edition. Let's go. Give us something good. In my opinion, the German one is okay. But it was lacking in terms of the pulls. This packet doesn't want to open up. And we got a Kosovo. All right. Second packet. And I just dropped him. Marco Royce got tackled. Free kick, Germany. All right, here we go. We're back on again. McKenna, defensive rock for Scotland. Packet number three. Eric Dyer, fans' favourite. 
Here we go. These are all the codes. Last packet from the Swedish or the Nordic edition mini tin. Let's find out if we're going to pull something good out of it. And let's see how good the limited editions are. Game changer, Kramerich. And that's it. So, we pulled Game Changer, we pulled a fan's favourite, we pulled Kosovo team, and we've pulled a defensive rock. Not bad. That's not bad. Um, no top masters. That's alright. We'll see what limited editions we've pulled from the Swedish one. Hopefully, there will be an old dick edition. We'll find out. Stop diving! Stop diving! Royce, Seamus Coleman, diving. Kevin De Bruyne is the first limited edition from the Swedish market or Nordic market. Let's see. The second one is... Boom! Ah, oh, we got Timo Pukki. Norwich City got promoted to the Premier League in England. Unfortunately, it's a bit bent up top here. And this here. That and the bottom. Look at that. So they're not perfect in the Nordic market. And that will dock them some points. Two points down. Let's look at that as well. See? The Kevin De Bruyne. They're dinked. In the corners so the Swedish one the Nordic one will lose some marks and just because of that I'm gonna give it a seven do you agree six nine seven because of the Nordic limited edition for me the Polish one wins what do you guys think do you agree I think the Polish tin is the best out of them law Two limited edition cards you will not find in a lot of markets unless they're coming out in football magazines from Panini. Griezmann is the standard in Germany, so you only get one, so they lose points for that. But for the Swedish Nordic market, we got one Nordic edition Finland limited edition card and De Bruyne. But the damaged cards will make them lose points for the bad packaging. Yes, we did get maybe a game changer, but the Polish mini tin wins it for me. All right, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. We've compared three mini tins. We've done Germany, Poland, Sweden, Nordic edition. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give it the thumbs up, smash that like button, you know you want to. Subscribe to the channel, you know you want to do that as well, so do it. Hit that bell, you get notifications, you won't miss a video coming up on Red Cow FC. Alright, share the video with your mates, tell someone about the channel, put your comments down, let me know what you think. You like that, I'm going to do that with the big tins as well. Alright, till the next video, thanks for watching, thanks for your support, have some fun with the hobby. Alright, ta-ra for now.